And of course we've missed a spot. This silly rock here is I think the only thing remaining on this plateau where we want to build. We've cleared out all the room, rest of the resources, we've got a gate set up, and we've hopefully blocked the spawns with these uh, thatch foundations. We also tamed ourselves a new female pteranodon, which is going brilliantly with our males. So if we get these bred, we might end up with a decent little pteranodon. They're breeding happily away. We've got one baby already, but it's terrible. Now, it is time for us to do another community event. This time, we are going to do... Can we travel to people's... Oh, we cool. That's cool. We can travel to other people's teleport location. We are going to travel to the cube. The cube is our new upgraded maze, community maze. And let's give it a second to load in. As you can see, it's going to have some instant kill areas. That's what this sort of mirage is. That's going to be an instant kill area. My frame rate has dropped a little bit <laughs> when we arrived here. And I imagine it's only going to drop further. I don't know how people with less powerful computers are going to cope with this, but holy hell. Right, let's place ourselves down a bed. We did bring a bed. We cannot place this bed. Where did he say we could place the bed? There's an elevator on the bridge, or you can place a bed back where Ready is. Ah, so there's Ready's bed. So let's see. These are all too close to enemy foundations. I can't place this. Hmm. There we go. Bed there. And is that someone else spawning in? That is indeed someone else spawning in. That's Macro spawning in. So I'm completely naked. I'm going to do this in the nude because I'm expecting to die many times. So let's wait until we've had the rules explained to everyone. Okay, just while we're waiting for everyone. Should we have a quick look at what these insta kill zones do? Should we see? So if I jump off this, I should die the second I touch this zone. All right, you ready? Yeah, just instantly, and then the body falls through. Oh, the body does not like that. <laughs> That's so cool. Right, so if we fall in, we die. So if we touch those, there's no, there's no messing around. It's just an instant death. Right. No damage, no slow tick, just immediate destruction of my life. So we're going to have to be really careful when we get in. I see, I think I see some parkour. I think these bits along the edge here are going to be where the parkour sections are. I'm not, I'm not sure exactly where we start. The vault is unlocked. Grab one. Gra what? Grab a big foot? Okay. Up its stamina. I don't know. It's got levels. I'm going to up its stamina. A bunch. And then maybe it's melee just in case. I don't know what I'm doing. Oh, there won't be any fighting. Ready asks if we're allowed to level them up. I already leveled it up. All right. So we all have a monkey. I wouldn't get it. <laughs> okay. I'm going to call her Hope because I hope she'll survive. All right, where do we go? We go in here. Oh, I love how everyone waits. And then, then he says, go and we're in. All right, we're going to go to the left. Nothing here. Oh, we've already gone wrong. Fucking wonderful. But it's a bit floaty how it moves. Oh, hello. What's this? Yeah, I'm not a fan of how they move. They're very floaty. Okay, what have we got over here? 
Uh, keep going left. Yeah, just keep following this left wall. I think that's the trick for mazes. You're supposed to pick a wall and just follow it. Obviously, that's worked well for me. <laughs> uh, Jorgen said that the frame rate got better once we were inside, and it has. That's true. So that's good. Okay. Big hallway here. Leads to absolutely nothing. So we've... we've I think we're really far behind. <laughs> that's good. I already have a bad feeling. There's Macro. <laughs> He's just come from here, though, which isn't doesn't bode well for me going this way, does it? Uh, watch me end up back outside. There's someone else. We've been here before. I don't like this. I'm right. Okay. We're going down this one and then we're going to follow the left wall. So this is the outer wall here. We know this is the outer wall. Okay, so we're going to just follow the left from this point. Okay, and we failed immediately. Ready has made it to stage two. What the fuck? How? I'm so lost. Oh, I feel so inadequate. And my monkey needs a poop. I'm really glad I leveled its stamina, actually. The heck? Ready says fuck. Ready just says the word fuck in chat. <laughs> I wonder if we can guess what's happened. <laughs> I, oh, oh, hello. Shit, I've got no idea how to get back to that place. Oh, okay. Oh, no. Oh, this is so hard. Look at this. No! 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 Oh, died! My Giga died! My Giga? My my monkey died. Alright. So we got to... Um, we got to the second stage that time, which is nice. I'm going to put the bed on the hot bar, so I'll make picking it up and putting it down easier. Technically, we've only died once. There are two green beams, but that's because we wanted to experiment with the insta-death. Right, let's take a boy this time. Let's let's see if that helps, because obviously that's going to be a big factor. Okay. I'm not going to bother leveling this one up. I've, I've lost hope now. Hope is dead and gone. Right. So I think everyone's pretty much figured the maze bit of it out now. As you can see, I've died a bunch of times in uh, the start of the second section. So for the maze bit, you just come down here, go through here, get to this, turn right around here get to this turn right and then i think you follow this and then you turn right here and then you're there so you see we've got the maze bit memorized all of us have got the maze bit pretty much memorized now so i think jorgen's putting in this teleporter here so we can just come straight to this section and keep going with our attempts at part two of the challenge because if we've all, all figured the maze out, then it's no longer a challenge. It's just a bit of a time sink. So It's good that he's willing to, like, change his plans and adapt and stuff. It's such a cool challenge that he's built for us. Right, let's see. Let's let Rasputin go first. Wait a second! I figured it out. I forgot that they could do this. That's how you get to the, the, the bit. That's how you get to the far bit. So you get up there and then he throws you maybe. Maybe? Surely. I don't know. We'll see. We have to actually get there. And that's a bit tricky. Oh, 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 oh. I sound like the goddamn... Monkey, I can't help it. I'm so nervous. Right, 
Right, so if he gets us to here, does he... surely it's not a jump, surely it's a throw from here. Is it a jump or is it a throw? It must be a jump. Or is it a jump there? Ah! No! I think it's a jump that way, but I can't get the sprint. Oh, this is so difficult. What the heck? Oh. Right, I have a plan. I'm not sure if the plan is good, but I've lost many, many, many lives, and I have a plan. Okay, look. We're going to get a bunch of monkeys. Because Jürgen can replace the monkeys. It's, it's not a problem. Oh, oh, okay. Macro took us with him then. Right, we're gonna grab our monkey. What we're gonna do is we're gonna up its speed. Okay, and we're gonna see if we can skip a chunk of the course. All right, I don't know if this works or not. But I see someone down there. Someone's doing really well. Right, okay, so we're gonna zoom and then we're gonna jump. Okay, so look how far that jump carries us. I wanna see if it's possible. Oh, it's possible. It's possible. It's possible. Okay. Okay. I'm clever. Right. <laughs> I don't know if Jorgen saw me. If Jorgen saw me, I might be in trouble. I don't know if he'll consider this a breach of rules. But the monkey was too fast. The monkey was too fast. Okay. So maybe like half of those levels. And we'll just grab a couple of monkeys just in case. Um, he sneaky hasn't seen me. He doesn't know the, the clever plan I've got. He's, he's not noticed me. Right, so let's put like half maybe of those points into movement speed. All right, so the reason I've got more monkeys is because sometimes I've been abandoning the monkeys like midway through. So we jump to here. All right, and then let's go a little bit more movement speed. He's here, he's watching. Alright, you ready? There we go! There we go! We just skipped a big chunk of it! <laughs> Alright, I don't know where we go from here though. No! We were doing so well! <laughs> Okay, so we figured out a way around a big part of it, but it's it's where we go from here we need to figure out. I'm I'm really really kind of like that little uh little alternate route we found. All right, let's grab let's just grab two monkeys at a time. He it's really easy for him to collect them. He's just soul gunning the dead ones, so it's not like I'm making a ton of work for him or anything. Okay, so Rasputin is. Going around it. How is Rasputin? Yeah, Rasputin's going around it properly. So we're gonna We're in this to win it, alright. This is no fucking community event anymore. This is this is we're in it to win it. This is the Olympics. So we're gonna jump. Alright. We're gonna wait. We're gonna see let's gonna see what Rasputin does, okay. Because here's the thing. Do we want <laughs> so you're gonna see my shock. <laughs> I'm asking if it's okay. We'll get permission from the big guy. Oh, he didn't mean me then. Okay, okay, no one knows what the, what I'm on about. That's fine. And we made it. Right, nice. So. Here's the thing now. We need to get over to that one. Let's see. Can we... Oh! We can't quite get over there. That's the issue. I'm wondering if we throw ourselves over. I like how no, I'm I'm being noy now. I'm not trying to do it properly. I, I'm trying to manipulate it and, and be cheeky, and that's not very sportsmanlike. 
But I want to fucking win. I want to win. I have a plan. Again, I have another plan. I have a different plan. <laughs> I have a cutting plan. If you get that reference, you're a cool person. There's one. Oh, oh, oh. There's two. There we go. There we go. I don't know if Jorgen's caught my shortcut. <laughs> See here, I can just throw my, I can throw myself up. Oh, I know what I can do. No, no, no. I know what I can do. That's like conscientious. I can go we. Oh, it didn't work. It didn't work. I, I thought I'd throw myself further than that. <laughs> I thought I'd throw myself further than that. And then I'd be able to like whistle the monkey into the death pit. This is as far as we've got. Okay, we're on this section now. I'm a bit concerned about how the f we get to there though. How the hell do we do that? Without throwing our monkey again, which I really do think is not a great tactic. Is that jumpable? Just, oh my God, just. <gasps> oh. Where the fuck do I go from here? What the heck? Just mass confusion. Huh. All right, I think. Hmm. I'm wondering if maybe we're supposed to be thrown over into that corner. But then I don't know where we would go from there, so I don't see why or how. Um, just instant death area. Right, I'm going to think about this. I'm going to ponder and percolate for a little minute and we'll see if we can figure it out. All right, so it looks like we just throw ourselves over here. Yes, I didn't want to risk it, but I suppose it does make sense. Okay, so then we go down. And... What? Oh, what's in this? Okay. Oh no! <laughs> oh, it's got a little flyer thing on it. No! And he said, follow the lights. So we go to the. It's so hard to follow the lights when we've died so many times, though. So we go to those lights and then to the blue lights, I guess. Oh, this is gonna be fucking tricky. I am bad at controlling this stuff too. Like, really bad at it. Okay. Bit. Uh, I'm gonna lose so much progress. Right, let's go. Let's try it. Come on, 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 There we go. Okay. And then what? Now we have to get over there. See, this is one of those moments where I don't think Jorgen has considered the possibilities. Oh, macro just flew straight over. Well, fuck. 
but I have this. Let's see if it works. I mean, no, no. Oh, we have to do it all again. I don't know if the checkpoint for number three has been unlocked yet or not, actually. Let's see. Let's pick up the bed, put it down. I think I might have been the last person to arrive at number three. Oh, hello. Uh, checkpoint three. There we go. Okay. What? Where the fuck are we? What? Did we drop down here? I think we dropped down here. Yeah, here we go. This is checkpoint three. Okay, so we put this. And then Macro just did it in one go. No fucking problem. Like a boss. Like this. Okay. Whoa. Whoa, 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 What? Okay, this is going to be tricky. Right, so we need to... We need to fly through that little maze thing, I think. Oh. This is stage three. There's four stages, I think. So we're getting there now. We're really getting there. And I do think it's still anyone's race. I think the, the way he structured it with the checkpoints only unlocking once everyone arrived at a certain sort of stage is really clever. Um, kind of makes it so that it's, it's a bit like a blue shell, you know, from Mario Kart. It, it targets the person in the front. It makes it continuously be an even playing field. Right. Oh, it didn't let me. Oh, no. <laughs> okay, let's keep let's keep at this and we'll see how, if we manage it. All right. We did it! We got through! Oh my god, we got through! Oh! Once all runners reach this point, the checkpoint will unlock. There we go. Okay, so we made it to the fourth zone. It's another maze. Filled with bodies. But I think they're just falling in, so that's fine. This point, I'm mostly just this way out, certain death. Okay. Do we trust your organ? Yes. Okay. Oh, do we have to get across this? Ready's just one. Well done, Ready. All right, this is quite tricky. Yeah, we didn't need to put the wings out for that. But we've just about done this one. And now we're down in this next section. Okay. Right. Let's see. Rady said something about in the chat about spiders, so let's be careful. This is my body. I've died here and dropped a bunch of monkeys. I, I guess I'm not supposed to use the monkey if the spiders and whatnot. 
Yeah, I think that would be maybe a bit... Yeah, I'm not going to do that. We're not going to, like, fight through the spiders with the monkey or anything. We're going to play it properly. Okay, so... Go up this ramp. Dead spider? The fuck? I'm going to show Yogan my monkey. No! My! <laughs> I bet I've got more somewhere. Oh, fuck. What was that noise? Okay, it doesn't let us do that. I was kind of hoping it would let me do that. I'm gonna ask him, would that be against the rules? To have a monkey. This is how I play games. I'm a terrible gamer, like, for mod games and stuff. I'm a rules goblin who tries to find exploits and loopholes. Okay. Where the fuck is this taking us? Eight box has now been locked. Yeah, okay, so... I won! I came second! I did it! I finished it! <laughs> oh my god! I'm so happy! Oh! I'm just gonna chill. Oh! Oh, I see macro! Macro! Give him a, we'll give him a, what am I doing? Give him a wave. All right then, that was fucking awesome. That was such a cool, well-designed little uh, thing. Can we have an ape? Yeah, that's a great idea. I want a monkey too. I want to see if my uh, my original monkey's in the box. Right, let's use the Omni tool to teleport back. So we teleport to the cube. Uh, let's see if hope is in here or not. Oh, it's it's locked. I can't unlock it. I don't think um, I mean I can actually I could just go Like that and then I could just unlock it There we go. Now it's unlocked <laughs> No, hope hasn't survived Someone got Toto Sniffer here though and Mr. Bean but no hope. Oh, that's a shame. All right, we'll take we'll take a unleveled one, and we'll name her Hope too. <laughs> Don't even know what stats she's got, but there we go. We've got a level. Oh, she's got zero stats because she's level one without any levels put in her. Fantastic. So she's not game breaking. She doesn't change our like ability to play the game or anything. But there we go. Hope 2 is our memorial monkey of the Grand Cube. But that is it. The second community challenge on our Fjorda server has been complete. Thank you very much for watching and good. Bye.